we play. We fight. We conquer. Welcome back to the Freak Show. I am your host, Bumpy McSquiggums, and we're continuing with Disgaea 5 Complete Pretties Only Dude Edition. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, the pretties are back, and they are here to do some more madness, mayhem, and monkeying around, I, guess. I, I don't know. It, it's fine. Anyhow, we, we're going to go explore some treasures. We have one here, the Mysterious Blade. I believe there's one right up here. Don't want to talk to you. Sorry. No, still don't want to talk to you. Hit the wrong button. There we go. Tayaki. Then if I'm not wrong, there was one over here. All right. So that is all well and good and done and sweet, sweet, nice styles with a Z. We got a 154, 146, a 113, a 96, an 89, an 86, an 82, a 90, and 77, and a 73. And Usali is 68. So, a pretty good chunk of levels out on Ur, buddy. So, good times are had by most, if not all. And, yeah, we're, we're getting there. We're getting there slowly. Pretty Tanad is struggling a little bit, but, you know, he's there. He, he's at kind of the, the back of the bus, but he's also, you know, he's allowed to be there. He's the newest member, so he shouldn't be on par with the pretty god himself, Bumpy McPrinty. It all sort of makes sense. That being said, let's hop in and yeah, let's dude. go to Toto Bunny. All right. It is time for the Tranquil Castle Wall. Nope. Uh, let's skip demo. There we go. And that is a large quantity of Zambies that are all over the place here. Like a whole bunch of Zambies. All right. Well, I mean, I don't feel like they're going to be overly powerful, but... You never know. We'll start with our yeah, our new recruit. Let's see what kind of damage he can do. Enough to take these guys down. Very good. Yeah, Very good. Uh, I think we do a pretty barrage from here. Oh, wait. You don't have pretty barrage yet. Never mind. Well, that's weird. I believe we actually have a worse weapon on you. I found a little bit of a better weapon. Sorry, more Pernicus. You're gonna have to, you're gonna have to chill out for a little bit. A Lionheart. You don't have the best weapon either, to be honest. Yeah. But you do have the Pringer Beam. That might be enough. Nope. Holy, what are you bringing to the table, my friend? You brought enough. You brought enough to the table. Pretty axis, kind of weapon. Okay, you've got a decent one. Very nice. We're gonna have exiled. Kind of come over here and take care of these guys with the a bomb of doom. Oh, the bomb does not work. Hmm. Confusolade. Ah, we can we can do things a little bit different. We can bomb Sunny from there. We can have Cupo Prinny come over here. And do not have Fusillade. Well <laughs> but Prinny Drogue. I think you need to be like a hundred or like ninety-four or something to get it. Alright, there we go. We have fusillated up oh, was not enough to finish him. That is uncomfortable. Alright, well, we shall fusillate ourselves as well with good old party pretty star. I'm gonna step out boldly and prepare myself for the inevitable attack against us. We'll get the rest of our printies ready to go at least. So when things are about to happen, at least a few folk are ready to go. All right, let's get it going. Soulbind came through. They're attacking our big, our big boys. Not really much going on there. Holy says he's gonna. He'll take care of it in a minute. First things first. 
We're not real thrilled that we're being attacked. But we're gonna beam it up. Do it, dude. And then before we depart, we get Holy to come over and use an item to purge the nasty off of us. That's right, it's gonna be the fairy dust. We'll send Commissar over here. Or party pretty sar over here as it were. Pretty barrage straight ahead. It's fine. Stamina shard, we got our revenge mode activated. Fusillade. No big deal. I shall step forward and tank the gank, so to speak. Very nice. Again, a couple pretty doesn't quite have the fusillade going his way, but it's all right. He can still get things done. He is not ashamed to do what it is he came to do and make a mockery of all of our foes. Alright, so we're going to make the move here. We're going to beam it up. We're going to make... Cup of pretty move here. We're gonna bomb these guys out. Gonna move out with more Predicus. He's got the crit coming. I mean, he already had the crit coming either way. But he's gonna bring a little bit of uh, pain along a side of it. And pretty Drog says he's got this. Don't even worry about it. Very good. I shall continue my onslaught moving forward. We'll beam it up. It's getting all the shards going our way this time around. There's not a tremendous amount of zombies left on the left side, I don't think. I think it's a more heavy focus on the right hand side. We'll see. I think that's going to be our split. Yep, there's a fair few, but not a, not a ton. All right. I mean, they they grouped up rather nicely over here. I think with the right bomb attack here, we can set this left side up for just an easy victory with a quick beam. There it is. A lot of zombies over here, not super happy. We're beaming it up again. They're not thrilled that we're just kind of taking care of them. All right, pretty Tanat, maybe get hit with a bomb here. Absolutely can. Again, being shown a little bit of love. Sadly, nothing doing on that front there. And that's pretty much it. All right, let's see what they got. That's sort of how I figured it would go. I think they're outside my range. Nope, they're not. Very cool. Very cool, and if I'm not wrong... Oh, I am wrong. Well, that's unfortunate. All right, I will handle it. Don't worry, guys. That's why I'm here. Workshop intern. Okay, we'll take it. We did it, dude. Skip the demo, yeah. All right, Carrot Garden, we're gonna heal up. I don't know if anyone actually gained any levels. There's events to go get spoken did did about. Uh, there we go, there's Zorokin. Hello, Zorokin. Goodbye, Zorokin and crew. Alright. It's all good. Let's Hospital. You up. Quick visit. There. 
Uh, Subquests. That should be easy enough. Target item is strange feelers. Maybe? Are we friends now? Sure. Probably have a couple muscles laying around. Let's put the 100,000 damage up on the line. I mean, we're not there yet, but we might as well put it there. And we might as well add this to it as well. And then I think that's it. Did we get any done? Are we friends? We should have the muscles, right? Yeah. I'm just gonna get rid of them. I, that's fine. Thank you. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. We don't we don't have five fist weapons yet? Buy five thimbles. What was the other thing that we needed? Strange feelers. We needed what, like five of those as well? Yep, there we go. I said, a couple of those seem pretty easy to do. <laughs> really, dude? Really? Alright. And then this one, five fists, conclude, manual select, thimbles. Alright, simple and easy. Sweet, sweetness styles with a Z. Alright, so everybody's healed up, ready to go on to the next part of the like mission. Go, and see where that's going to put us. When we're done with this episode, I think the next episode before that happens, we're going, we're going to probably... I'm thinking about it, I'm thinking about it... Maybe we'll push everybody up uh, quite a bit higher in level, and then we'll just continue to breeze through things. Like, right now, we're doing pretty good. Things are looking real solid for us, so I have no problems with continuing that trend. Yep. Hopefully you guys are down with it as well. All right, we got a bunch of folk around with a willow as the big boss lady. All right. Yeah, well, yeah, Bumpy McPurney's got no qualms about just going straight on in at someone. Yeah, yeah, dude. I think yeah, that's going to be totally fine. Uh, yeah, dude. Pretty tonot. Does your bomb do enough? Not quite. I, dude. Wow, dude. You are on the short end of that. You, dude. Of course, we have Cannibal Printies doing Cannibal Printy things. Pretty Drog is going to come with me. A couple of Printies going to handle whatever's on the side. And I think that's going to be fine. Uh, Pretty Oxus going to come over here. We got Holy Printy. Pretty Rupert. I mean, honestly, there's not really much that anybody's bringing to the table right now. But these levels are all pretty easy, right? They don't need to bring much to the table. Oh. There's some medical care to make their guys a little bit stronger. Alright, Pringer Beam. Let's screw that up. Excuse me. There we go. I guess we can bomb them. I will, dude. More Pritikus. Get over here, my friend, and give me potato salad. No, um, you know what to give me. Give me the fairy dust. Pretty barrage handled. And essentially, we're just maneuvering into position to deal with whatever we got to deal with. Okay, a little bit of a weakening situation there. Hey, 
perfect for uh, Pretty Tana to step up his GAME and get things handled. Pringer Bomb as well. And I think we're going to do it again. Death Santa stood no chance. And I believe that's the right split for the bomb. It is. All right. We have three folks left to deal with. I mean, they, they tried. They did not do much, though. Sadly, I think the bomb will hit. It will. We'll not finish. Hmm. Your bomb will not finish either. However... It's time for more Perdicus to get in here and get some stuff done. There we go. That Cinderella story ended a rather abruptly there. I think Pretty Oxus could use a little bit of love here. There you go. And uh, finally, we're gonna, uh, I guess, fuselage, fuselage, whatever it is. We're gonna, we're gonna do that thing. That. Super easy. We're skipping the demo. We're just kind of breezing through it, you know? I mean, like, they want to talk with us, they want to converse, they want to fight back, but they really can't. Let's fix you the pretty up. squad is strong. And it should be feared by all. Go, dude? Really, dude? Really. Should really be feared by all. Back to Toto Bunny, the Compassion Street. See if we can't push forward. If things go well, I'm just going to try to skip ahead uh, through this a little bit more as we go. Group activity is active. I don't know what that means. Nor do I particularly care, but... Yeah, yeah, dude. Do it, dude. Oh, straight off with the revenge. Okay. Uh, no, not barrage. Fusillade. Bomb. Do it, dude. I'm gonna eat you, dude. Party pretty sir. Cannot reach that. Maybe with a nope. Okay. Yeah, dude. Exile. We're just gonna bring the cream of the crop yeah, dude. thus far. I mean, it's not really like like they didn't do anything to become other than just like the order in which I birthed I'm eat you, them. Dude. All right, that's it. The rest are staying back. More enemies have come out of the base panel. Oh no! Whatever will we do? Unfortunately, that one is super far away. I think I can just do this. Say, clear out a gigantic chunk of them. And then I think they all lined up perfectly for the follow-up here. Yeah, they did. Not really the play. I think we've got a fusillade for him. And yeah, that's basically it. I mean, I Do guess it, Bobby McBurney can come over and hang out. You know, the base panel boys. Uh, but basically, I believe it's going to be Party Pretty Star handling most things beyond this point. So, I think the bomb will hit there. It will. I think that leaves us with like one dude left to deal with. Plus, the you know, whatever reinforcement comes out. Which, I am uh, medium hesitant, but still pretty sure that we've got this. Not the ultra zombie beam. Whatever will I do? Just attack with a basic attack. Put you down. Yep, that's exactly what I'm gonna do. All right. We're gonna move here. We're gonna move there. We're gonna fusillade this guy down. We're gonna move here and done. Yeah, 
still can't quite reach. It's okay. One more turn's fine. One more time. Once more into the breach. I mean, we could keep going, but yeah, you get the idea. I figure we'd go with uh, some of the lower level dudes if we needed to. It would all be fine. All right, let's step it up. Mr. Printy Barrage from Mr. Party Printisar. And, oh, one of these came out instead of the others. All right. We're going to go with the Fusillade once again. Uh, I think we're doing like 38,000 damage. That's not bad. It's not too bad. We'll skip the demo. Cooperation Plaza. Very nice. Uh, let's get the demo. Absolutely. Ah, good. We like to see this stuff. How's your bomb gonna handle? Ooh, not that good. And do you have the beam? You do. The beam is enough. The beam is enough. And the bomb is also more yeah, than enough. Yeah, and we got a bunch more of bunnies ready to come over and play yeah, with us. Dude. All right, let's see what they got. Carrot funnel they threw our way. That is underwhelming to be sure. I don't feel very whelmed. Up your whelming, guys. Up it. Yeah. Up it a lot. Tenfold. I want tenfold the amount of whelming that I just felt. Alright. That is a large amount of carrot carrot crunchers over there. Unfortunately, I don't believe my barrage. Oh, oh I'm wrong. From that angle. The barrage works. Alright, let's give this a shot. Okay, so so unofficially he's a pretty god right now. Uh, he's not actually allowed to be that, but it's fine for you know the current dealy. They're bringing the hate. They're trying. They're doing everything they can to take us down. But I mean, oh, you know they actually hurt me a little bit there. I thought I saw a zero. Oh, you know what? Maybe it was leveling up. Or maybe they hurt me. I don't know. I'm not real sure. Hmm. What if we do the... The bomb st... Wow. I'm a little concerned, actually. Hmm. This is not great. Okay, that worked out. I'm like, uh, he might move up and get that 50% attack and actually take our guy down. I was a little concerned, but we, we all good. We handled it. Alright. Cooperation Plaza is handled, and we still have plenty of time to continue. Let's go and heal, though, before we continue. Also, everybody wants to talk to us in and outside the club. They seem maybe like they're tipsy. I'm not real sure. Let's fix you up. Yeah, let's fix me up. All right, back to it. Come on. Where would you like to go, dude? I want to go back to Toto Bunny, of course. Duh. Toto Castle Gate. Should have skipped the, uh, the delay. I didn't. It's okay. We'll skip it here. All right. Oh, look. It's a Majorita. Do it, dude. I will do it, dude. Yeah, dude. All right. I think Commissar, yeah, dude. Exiled, and Bumpy McPrinty are going to handle this. I think that is just fine. Finger beam. Yeah, dude. 
Can we beam us up again, a good sire? Alright, and I'll move my way on down. Now, Jarita, Bumpy McPretty's coming for you. Oh, look at the pretty stuff! So I was like, we gotta keep up. We gotta protect the pretty god. And the pretty king. See, he's just all around a good guy. He wants to keep us all safe. You know, and I can appreciate that. Yeah, yeah, dude. Alright, more, more Eminiminiminis. Coming. Necro away. Ooh, we actually took damage. That is a rare and... We'll say beautiful. A rare and beautiful thing. Well, unfortunately, Majorita despite her potty mouth, did not survive. Alright. Basically, double zombies remain, and honestly, that's okay. And, uh, Exile's like, don't worry, I got you, party pretty sir. I got you, I won't let him take you. Uh, oh. There's another one. There's another zombie that I did not see. Well, since everybody's fusillating, I suppose Party Pretty Sara can do it as well. Alright, and love surrendered. That's good. It's good. And that is the preview. Done and dusted, folks. Done and dusted. Very nice. Alright. Train more at the martial training. Cheat shop CP minimum became 45. A lot of good stuff. So, uh, yeah, I'm pretty happy with how this has gone. Alright, let's, uh, let's talk to, since we're right near Seraphina over here. Good old Seraphina. We can get some of these chats out of the way. My god, she doesn't want to stop talking. Are you done now? Yeah, now you are. We found one of the treasure chest looty thingy boxes. Well, we found another. Yeah, That's Dos. Dos Boxios. And Trace. Alright. So. We have a few options available to us here. Let's go do this. Yeah, nope. Where would you like to go, dude? Just gonna get this out of the way, so we can actually access things. And I believe in the next episode, folks, we'll probably uh, there's more people I want to talk. We will probably go and unlock the new martial training thing. Uh, chances are I will probably do that off camera, but we won't actually go and do battle with it. Well, let's go take a look at the strategy assembly here. That's usually not something that you can pass very easily, so. Train more at the martial training, 17%. So it's going to require a little bit of bribery. A little bit of, uh, you know, maybe some, some force. Worst case scenario. But, eh, by and large, I think it'll be okay. We'll be fine. And, yeah. So the next episode, look for that. We'll continue on. I believe Toto Bunny actually is a good place to level up. That last level that we just did. I believe that's going to be a really solid place to level if we are so inclined to do so. And on top of that, we do have the other martial training one, the one that we've already done, that we can go to. And once we do this next one, that'll probably be even better. So, a lot of stuff to see, a lot of stuff to look forward to. That's all going to be in the next episode, guys and gals. So, new PC, new PC is on its way. Um, current computer, current PC is uh, sort of dying a slow death. and has been for the past, uh, eh, probably like two months. I just got really bad in the last week or so. So I'm only going to be able to record probably another couple of episodes before the big switchover. And we'll see how all that goes. Everything should be fine. I'll make sure that I, before I delete anything off of this computer, um, I'm able to access it on the other computer. And that means if I can't access it on the other computer, I'll start looking for the saves, you know, manual saves that are hidden somewhere on this computer for each game. So... Hopefully we don't lose any more uh, save files or anything else. I know there's one or two games that I haven't quite started back up yet due to when I had to basically reinstall Steam. Uh, we lost our save files on that. Himiko Satori is one of those 
And there's a few others that really like Falnarian Tactics 2 we lost. I was going to be doing some more of that. And then there's just no save file. So uh, anything that I didn't restart, we'll just restart it fresh. I've actually waited a little bit for that as well. We'll restart fresh once the new PC's here. Anyway, big giant uh, monetary commitment that I'll be paying for for years. But hey, you know what? It, it has to be done. I can't do what I do here or with the Indie Bros if uh, I don't have a computer that works. And that works well, so... Necessary evil, I suppose. Anyway, folks, after all that is said and done, I'll actually be very, very happy to have the new computer. But all I see before me is a lot of struggles to keep this one running and a lot of work that I'll have to do after it gets here. So, yeah, we'll see. Anyway, folks, thanks for sticking around. Thanks for listening to me babble a little bit. And uh, I look forward to seeing you in the very next episode as the Pretty Squad continues their adventures in the land of Disgaea 5. We will finish this up before Disgaea 6 is out. And I'm hoping to also have Disgaea 5 completes main... Let's play, I guess. Completely done and everything 100%. We'll see. Maybe I won't be able to do it, but I'm going to give it my best shot. Anyway, folks, until the very next episode, I've been your host, Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by the Freak Show. Always remember, we play, we fight, we conquer.